Hey folks, it's Rithgar here. How you doing? Welcome back to Graveyard Keeper. I'm just getting a couple more loaves of bread out of the box. There we go. So I've got 20. We can run around with just 20 of those. And that's... Oh no, I needed... I was just wondering what else I needed to do. But no, over in the church we needed to change things... Um, change things around a little bit over there. No, what I'd like to do is I want to build a furnace too. And we'll be able to do that. I need 20 stone. I need 8 parts. And we need some pigskin paper. We've got the pigskin paper. That's not going to be a problem. We need some more complex iron parts. Because I want to do two furnace twos. Um, and we need some more stone. Stone shouldn't be much of an issue. We're going to have to watch the time. But what I was thinking is that we wouldn't get the stone from here even. What we'll do is we will use that bad boy right there. And we'll go over to the quarry. Over this way. Use our wonderful little quarry that we got here all lined up and all tickety-boo and wonderful. We've got marble up here, which we can't do anything with just yet. We can build the marble quarry. We're going to go and get some bits for that. And we can come back and do something with it. But for now, we're going to mine a couple of blocks of stone out of here until I've got... Well, probably... Yeah, see, this, this is a problem. You know, it, it moves that bit over there, and I don't want it to do that. What I want it to do is I want it to just sort of nudge the stone over sideways... Instead of dropping in front of me, don't drop in front of me. Right, now it seems to be going to the side of me. Slightly. Ah, now we're talking. Oh, now it's broke. Right, well, we knew it wasn't going to last forever. We'll have to go back and we'll have to go and fix it in a minute. Um, but this, I mean, this should be enough. We've got six pieces of stone here, and I think you get five for each one of these. So if we just run these through and then turn them into pieces of stone, that's going to be... Is it five for each one of these? I think it's five for each one. That's 30 pieces of stone, which is about what we want, actually. That's, that's not far off. Let's have a look. Uh, you get six pieces of stone. All right, well, that's 36 pieces of stone right there. That's more than enough. So I will sit here, and I will busy work through all of these until we've got everything that we want. Plus, we're going to get some red and green XP off of these as well. We should then be able to upgrade our furnaces always have a little wander around and instead of because I can't teleport back just yet anyway and look for some beehives because I know there's some beehives around here we have like there are a few in the woods that we can use so I, I think what we do is it's just a loop up around so we got one there now we do get honey but we can also we've now got the ability to occasionally pick up bees like that and once we unlock the next bit which is being able to um, build the beehives. We need 20 bees per hive, which is a huge number. That's uh, a mushroom that I picked up there. I, I don't actually want a mushroom. I want, yeah, there we go, bees. The big difference between a mushroom and a bee. One of them's on the ground, usually, and one of them's in the air. And one of them hurts you before you eat it, and the other one has got the potential to hurt you quite badly after you eat it. So there's some notable differences between the two. And it's always a good idea to be able to tell said difference. Okay, there's another one down here. I know, yeah, I, I know we've got at least these three. I can't remember if there are any more. There's definitely more down by the beehives. I do remember that much. And I've got another bee there. Have they increased the drop rate ever so slightly? I have a feeling maybe they have. Just a little bit. Not, not like a huge amount. But I don't remember getting... Yeah, bees really at all. We had, I think we got like one, maybe two. Like, it just seemed like such a low chance of getting bees. And I've gotten three then, have I? How many have I got? Three bees. Yeah, I got three bees now, which is pretty good going. Plus we've got a load of wax, which is going to be useful for making some candles. And go on, take that one up. What else we got? Oh, I only got honey on that one. I am taking a serious beating right now. My health has taken a real beating from these bees. They're more dangerous than I realized. There we go. Right, well, we got some more. We got another bee as well. 20 bees. Remember, we do need 20 bees. It's not like a case of just a couple. 20 of them. Actually, 20 bees. It's a huge number. That really is. That is a genuine, massive, huge, enormous, great big number of bees. Uh, I can... Drop that one. Okay, so we've got one furnace up here. Can I turn that round? And, oh, R for rotate there. Right, I can put one there. What I'd like to do is I'd like to put one there and one over there. But no, I, I can spread them out a little bit. I can put one over there and then 
that can do and then I can come over this way I do want to make some more of these which is actually the complex part so I'm gonna to go to 12 let's let's do 10 of these we'll, we'll do 10 lots of these so we got 30 complex parts because we do need these with quite a different number of um, items that we want to make I need to also make some stuff for in the church one of those things is is it time to sleep yeah all right we'll, we'll get some sleep um one of the things that i want to make in the church is in the basement the um i've got to do the complex glass cones and i also need um like the, the timber part so the timber cubes not cubes uh the timber timber something i don't remember what it is the, the, the beams timber beams isn't it i think it's beams i'm sure it is let's have a look have a look on you but that's uh that also needs the complex iron parts doesn't it to there no 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 right nothing doing on here there yeah, wouldn't beam i knew it complex iron parts we also need to go and get more trees so that's another thing that we need to do uh, i want two more bodies to be cremated at some point so i'm gonna need more trees for that so that we can finally build the columbarium in the graveyard and i tell you what that might actually be something we want to do now i got so many loaves of bread uh, that it's not going to matter in the slightest about that i can just keep spam eating bread just build that one there a minute right you're done and then i can go to you craft right here and go back to that one upgrade the furnace there that's going to require 50 energy to do this we're going to be able to do it Yes, I'm going to be able to do that without any problem. So, oop, not quite enough. Uh, eat those. Right, so we've now got an upgraded furnace there. Uh, I'll ignore the other furnace for now. I can make graphite in there. I've got fuel in here already from previous fuel. Uh, we can put two, two for two, basically, in there. And this is what we want here. So we want the um, conical flasks. We'll make all of the glass into conical flasks to start with, like that, and then we can turn those into the advanced conical flasks, which is the big thing that we're going to want. So we'll let those cook in there for a minute, and we're going to go over here, complex iron parts, simple iron parts, iron ingots, they can all stay behind, and we'll move the food indoors. I want to go to you, and I want to just do that one a minute. Um... What was it I wanted to do? No, there was some. Oh, there's the columbarium. I want to. I, I still want to do that columbarium, don't I? And leave the whetstone behind. And then we want to go up here and over to this chest. So it's still early morning. We're doing fine. Beeswax for candles. Uh, so I'll leave the honey here. I'm also going to leave. No, I'm taking the bees with me because I want to study them. Okay. Take the rest of it with me. We'll take all of it with me. And we want to go this way. So I've got to build more. Um, I've I got to build more places for the bodies. So if I just dig this tree up a minute. There we go. So I take you like that. And then I bring that one up. Uh, no, because I need to be able to do more cremations. That's what we need. We need to be able to do a couple more cremations. I think I've got two bodies in the morgue that we can use to do that which means that we'll then be able to do said cremations let me just go and check actually i can't remember if we got two or one in here and if we've only got one this is going to be really embarrassed okay well this is awkward yeah right okay so we can't actually do that i wanted to make a marble columbarium in here and that's not something that's going to happen so we'll not worry about it we won't worry about it in the slightest what i will do is I'll give him his fish. You're my saviour. I hope that didn't sound blasphemous. <laughs> and by the way, I forget to mention that you'll need to get a building permit to perform any construction upon the royal lands. As far as a permit is concerned, I'm afraid you're on your own. I try to avoid their soulless, greedy bu bureaucracy at any cost. Great. Uh, trade? What have you got? Nothing, really. Right, so we need to have a look in here. I've got citizen, I get a royal stat building permission. 20 silver? Are you kidding me? Right for the citizen, uh, town papers, town pass. Now, the town pass I'm not sure about. Right for citizen papers. Aristocrat, there. Aristocrat papers. 
It's, I'm pretty sure that we can't actually go into the town at the moment. I don't think that the town is even a thing that's available right now. A little bit disappointing, I, I, I will admit. But, um, yeah, uh, as far as I know, the town is coming later as either, like, a big expansion or a DLC or something. But, I mean, I don't know. I could be I could be completely talking nonsense right now. And you could all be saying, well, what are you talking about, Frith? The, the town's right there. You can go to the town anytime you want to. Is it, I mean, seriously. Are, 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 what? Frith, seriously. You've been smoking something that's a little bit strange, and quite frankly, we're all a little bit concerned. Um, oh, no, I don't blame you. I don't blame you to white paint. I need the alchemy bench. We've got the fat. We've got the beeswax. We can make candles there. So you get those candles there. These here. And then we've got incense there, which we need the freshener for, which we make out the alchemy bench. So, yeah, we've got a lot of stuff that we want to make. We'll, we'll, we'll ignore all of that. Let's go and do a prayer. So we, we had 35 last time, and it, it worked quite well. I was quite pleased with our 35. I'd like to say some words. Our church is great. Nice. I prefer May the Force be with you. Quite honestly, I thought that was a better sermon. Um, and they say you only did it the first time. Okay. Just okay. Is that it? We're, we're just getting okay. So we got seven faith there instead of the nine. Uh, donations are welcome. Great sermon. Everybody piles out and they give me piles and piles of money. The money bit is the bit that I like. I got I got to be honest with you. The money bit is my favorite bit. So we take all of that faith there. We've already got some on us anyway. And uh, we take that. Right, now we can head back this way and we can do some study. Have we got... No, we're not even close to 20 silver at the moment. We're going to need to do just a teensy little bit more work. That's all right. We can do work now. First, I want to go to there to the Keeper's Key, and I want to study that one. That is going to get me 10 points. All right, that's not as much as I'd hoped, I've got to be honest with you. We'll take the B, and ooh, I'm out of stuff. Okay, we go to the paper there. Decompose all of those eight papers. Then go back in here and go to the B, and that's going to give me three, which is 30. So that's 30 green. Or it should be 30 green, at least 30 green. 79, 108, it is 30 green. And then we'll go for a mushroom. All right, let's go with the nails a minute. That's one on there. So that'll be another 10 reds. Get those. And it's t yeah, that is 10. What else? Oh, do I do those? or do I, I'll, I'll do the mushroom. Uh, see, I kind of want to do... Oh, okay, two is good, two is good. Um, I kind of want to do things that I'm not necessarily going to keep hold of all the time. And I figure it's sort of a bit more prudent to do it that way around. So that is everything that I can do on there. Now we go to technologies and in here. So we've got embalming table there. But I was actually thinking in book writing, we've got the writers there. The desk two, the bookshelf. Um, we've got a paper press up here. The playwright there for 100 blue would be quite good. And then we've got like the printing press stuff. So writers stuff. That's good. Uh, gardening, brewing, bee domestication. It's going to get us a lot more. The vine press, the winemaking. I, 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 see, I, I never know which one to go for first. I'm always torn. You may not have noticed. I know what I do want to do. We want to get the weapons and the armor because we're soon going to want to be heading down into the dungeon. Uh, you know how to increase your furnace productivity. You can smelt more or per load. Let's not worry about that one for a minute. Go to building, and I got nothing in there at the moment. And nope, 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 nope. Oh, that was the one I was going to go for, but now I can't do it. Let's go up here, nothing doing in there. And you, I've still got the embalming, so we'll take the embalming tables. Fridge, pallet, embalming table two. Unlock. Right. There's a little bit more stuff in there. Now we go up this way, and we go to you, and we've got. The alchemy mill needs two polished brick of stone, and the alchemy workbench too. I may as well go straight to that one. Needs steel parts. Do I have those unlocked yet? Smithing, steel, steel castings, steel parts. Right there is in a furnace three, and a furnace three is the blueprint that I get for that. I, yeah, I'm not gonna be ready for that one for a little while, am I? That's that's gonna take a bit. All right, we'll, we'll come back to that one. That's fine. We can come back to that. What have I got in here? My character. Uh, oh, I forgot to leave the prayer behind. If I run down back over here and I'll... 
just wondering. Should I? No, I'll leave. I'll leave the prayer over here. We're going to build more storage in here very, 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 very soon, um, and probably even sooner than that. Right, keeper's key, active key. But I don't know which one I'm supposed to use. I've got two of these keys now, and I'm not really sure which one would be the best one to use. I, I, no, I don't think it really matters, to be honest. Now, is Snake going to turn up, or does he not turn up? I don't think Snake turns up. I don't think I have to worry about him. We'll leave that, and yeah, I'll ignore that lot, so I can come out here. Ooh. Okay. Glass is good. Frithgar, likey glass. Okay, and I go to here. I want to build this one up, so I need 50 energy to build this one. We also want to make some more flitches, and, um, well, there's quite a few different things that I need to make. So, craft in here, that's just, oh, that's all just firewood in there and wooden wedges, so there's nothing that I actually want from that. Uh, no, what I want to do is I want to make them on here, and I want to make quite a few more. So, I'm going to load that one up with more trees. Let's go to you. There's one tree. I really do hope they make it that we can carry more than one log one day. Carrying more than one would be absolutely awesome. Oops. There we go. Go, 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 go. And you, and then put you over into there as well. Right. It's getting late. And I'm actually thinking that it's gotten late enough now that we might be able to go and see Snake again. Have a little chat with him. He's a wonderful bloke. He really is. He's he's um, he's he's widely misunderstood, I think, by a lot of people. So we've got ten. I don't know what the salt is for. I'm sure it's going to be useful for something. I just got no clue what it might be. Came out here to drop the stone down. We'll see. Now go this way. Oh oh oh! Armor. Did I ought to be making the armor before I come down here? Well, he's not here at the moment. Might need to wait until the night that he is due to come. Because, you know, he's, he does come here on that one night. Hmm. I'm not sure, actually. Uh, right, armor. Where can we make armor? Can I make it on this? Yes, there we go. Right, iron armor. I need four skin. I've got those. The skin, I can go and get that. That is just over in the church. It just so happens that we have some. Is Snake going to have turned up yet? He's still not here. I'm a bit disappointed in you, Snake. I thought you were a bit more regular than this. Let's come down and around and weave through and then go to you. And one, two, three, four, skin. And I'm going to go... Oh, what have I got? No, I don't have carrots. So I don't think we're going to get any more bodies for a little while because we don't have any carrots down here. I do want to have a look and see what the fridge pallet is and what it requires. We've got there... 12 flitches, 12 nails, and 5 complex iron parts. That's not too bad. Plus a mortuary rack. We could build a mortuary rack in here. And I'm pretty sure that is something that's just going to allow us to uh, keep some of the bits in the mortuary. Rather than having to run them up to the church bit every time. It is a little bit inconvenient having to run around like that all the time. Let's take you. Alright, I will just go here. No, I'm not going to wait. Snake's not here. We don't need to worry about Snake. Let's not worry our pretty little heads about him. We will go over here. We've got that one to dig up. How many seeds do we get this time? We've got three beet seeds this time. And I go... Nope, no, F. Plant. There. Put those in. i got one beet seed left. A single solitary beet seed left. There's the beet and there's those. And I'm going to make more compost, actually. There. Get those cooking in there. So I've got three lots of that. It's now daytime. I'm go Rather than going to sleep, I'm just going to go up here and I'm going to grab another stack of bread. Uh, I'm going to take all of the bread. Just like that. I'll take the whole lot and I can start... Oh, I'm out. I start off by eating four of them. Like that. And then we've cleared up one stack. And I need to go to this table... No, I don't. To go to this table here. There. That's what I want to make. I want to make iron armour. Then when I've done that, I need to go to this table over here. Oh, hang on. No, first up, I want to go... Oh, I've got it on. I've got two armor that I'm wearing right now. And Oh, it's the fishing rod that one is. Right, so I'm ready to go and battle all kinds of dangerous, vicious creatures. Just not quite sure how long before we can go and do it. We've got to see Snake. And he's, he turns up 
well, he turns up in the night, but I... See, I thought it was during the snake night, but uh, the, 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 the snake thing... He, like, he, he was there, or I thought it was during the day, but he wasn't, and then he was... Well, maybe it's just in the night on that one. You get, like, two evenings where you can speak to him, and then that's it. And you, you're not allowed to speak to him any other time. It might be that. It might be. And we got one more on there. Okay, that's good. And then we can go here to wooden billets. we got nine for the wooden billets. There. Twenty-seven of them. That'll make... See, twenty-seven. Twenty-seven of these, and that only makes for three. Right, we can only make three places for burning bodies with that. And I quite frankly, I think it could be better than that. Uh, what is that Z right there? Is that because I haven't been to sleep for absolutely ages and I've just been eating food instead? I've never seen that before. Does anybody know what that is? I'm confused. I don't like when strange things happen. Oh, ah, you need to sleep or you'll keep losing it. Oh, right. Okay. So we've got to sleep or we keep losing energy. It gets to a point where you've got to sleep. Right? You have to sleep. You, you can't not sleep. Makes you. Even if you've got stacks and stacks of food. I genuinely didn't know that this was a thing. I'm, I'm actually really pleased that this is a thing. This, this delights me. It really does. It absolutely delights me that this is a thing. And there's one thing I did forget to do. And that was to go and give the donkey some more carrots. So I will just go and get some carrots over here. And then I will give the donkey his carrots and he will be happy. If I do that, I want to take 10. Not 20, but 10. There. 10 carrots for the donkey. I do wish there was a gateway down here. I know it's only a small thing, but a gate down there would just make our life a little tiny, tiny little bit easier. It's not like it's it, it's not a big thing to ask, is it? It's not a big thing to ask. Now, if I come over to here, nope, I'm going to you, and I'll drop those in there. So I got 33 of them at the moment, and that is enough. 32 is enough to make all of the the ones that I need. So I don't need to I don't need to make any more of them. Let's go up this way. It's night time now, so if we go to sleep, there. I do feel like I'm sort of staggering around a little bit as well. But a little bit of sleep, there. That's going to get us back on our feet. And I actually quite like that that is a little bit of a mechanic that we've got. That's, um, that's good. I, I, I don't know why this pleases me so much, but it does. It definitely pleases me. We've got a load more of those done. So we've just got two more of them to make. And now what else do I need? I know that I need two polished stones and polished brick. Go to you there. I need either polishing paste or I need an iron chisel. Do I have the ingredients out here for polishing paste? I don't have the oil. I used up all the oil previously. Right. Well, what we'll do instead is we'll make an iron chisel and I know it's a little bit slower, but I'm not going to worry too much about that at the moment. So just make that one there. Then I can go over to this side and I can make these. And you can only do these one at a time. That's what slows it down a bit. I think I need two of these. So I get two of those going there. You do get some of each. So I think it was two of them. Now, was there anything else that I needed? You know what? I honestly don't know. Oh, yes. Yes, there was. There was. There was. There was. There was in here. Nope, not in there. I need to go to this one. It's wooden beams. There. I'm going to make six of them. Because that takes the wooden beams and it uses the complex iron parts as well. I'm not sure why we're using complex iron parts. I'm sure there is a very, very valid, important, very sort of, you know, absolutely amazing reason for it. But I have no idea what it is. And I want to go to technologies over here because what I'm after is that one. And I don't have it yet. 250. So we're, we're what about halfway. Okay, all right, I've got time, I've got energy. Now I'm gonna head over this way. So the merchant is not here yet. Snake is not here yet either. He comes over tonight. So we have gotta wait for a little bit, but I do wanna go to you. What have we got? Well, I got those two, I need six of them. The Alchemy Workbench 2 takes jointing, which I don't currently have, all the steel parts, which I don't currently have. So I wanna skip the, except that, except that we don't wanna skip it, do we? 
No! Oh, Frith, you fool! You don't want to skip it at all. Right, well, you haven't actually done any damage anyway, so that's fine. Um, Distillation Cube 2. No, we want the basic one as well as the next one because some of the recipes you want to use on the basic alchemy workbench. Remember now. I remember now. Frithgar remembers. This is a good thing. Uh, hand mixer. So, I really, I could do the whole load of wooden planks. I think we, I think here we want one of everything. Like, you know, up in the yard, upgrading the furnace from a, a level one to a level two. You just want to upgrade. But this one here, it's a little bit different. Uh, what do I want to do now? Oh, I'm going to go back outside. We've got, that is now done there. So I want to build, uh, there's the jointing. And that is here. That one. Right, 250 and 20, so that I can get the joints. And 250 and 20 over here, so I need 400, 140. I got the 40. We've at least got the 40, but we don't do the rest of it. That's going to take a little while. So what is the best thing to do? Um, probably making sand and glass and stuff like that. That's, that is a pretty good way of earning energies. Um... Nothing I want to do in there. I mean, I could put some more fuel. Then we've got 340 fuel at the moment. We're not doing. We're going to have to go on a coal run soon. That is something that we are going to need to do. I want some fruit trees here as well. Let me go and pick this lot up. But I would pick this lot up, except that I am completely full. My bags are completely overflowing. All right, back up again, and we'll try and sort a few things out. Flitches. We're going to need flitches if we're going to make this work, aren't we? So let me... I don't really want to pick everything here, do I? I'll tell you what, I will pick everything. It's just going to make life easier. Pick you. And then pick you. And then I can go here and I can chop you down. Get you right out of the way. It's just these little shrubs on the side. They're a little bit of a nuisance. Right. You down over there, nudge you over that way, and then nudge you over that way as well, and then grab you down, and start heading up this way. So we've, yeah, i uh going to need several flitches. Can't remember what the mortuary storage rack is. That's the one that I want, though. I do want to be able to get that one, so we'll go in there, and then I'll head back. Oh, there's our first body. The donkey is delivered. Taking his five carrots as payment. And we've got one in this. We've got one up there and we've got one over here, which we can... Well, it doesn't matter whether we bury it or if we take it down to the bottom. This one here, we're going to whip everything out here. And, um, yeah, it doesn't matter if we bury or burn. It makes no difference. What, it does, what does matter is that um, we're going to end up with two more... I can say no, it doesn't matter. Of course it doesn't matter. We, we need to burn so that we can get the columbarium. That's what I wanted, was the columbarium bit. That's, that's the bit we're after. Mortuary rack, I need eight of those and six of those, and then I can make this mortuary rack. So let's do the mortuary rack a minute. That's what we want to do first. So we can go up there. We want to get eight flitches, and there's other flitches that I want as well for some of the other bits. So let me go to you, and 12 flitches will be fine on there. No energy. I can cure that. There, lots of energy. So how many days have I got to stay awake in order to burn off all my energy? Snake is going to be turning up down below very, very soon. We need to be aware of that. So there's my flitches. And I want to just go here and I'll get some more nails. I'll do 40 nails. And then I can pick all of them up. And we can take them down with us. Except I will go and see Snake first. Which is down below me. Just done. We want to go into our house, down into the basement. We can have a little chat, Snake. We've got no energy left at all. I'm not going to sleep. Nope, nope, nope. We're going to be a night owl. One, two, three, four, and five. There we go. Let's pick up those. So I've got another space in my bag. And go to you. So i got uh, four flitches there and two nails there. That is everything that I can carry for a minute. What I will do is if I go in here, I can leave two flowers behind. And that's going to give me a space. And then I've also got some mushrooms that I can drop up there. Put those in there. Now I've got a little tiny bit more space. And I should be able to see him. He should, there he is. Hello, Mr. Snake. I'm very pleased to meet you. Very pleased to see you. Give him the key. Here's the key. Task completed. we got a story. 
Right, what's he going to do? At last, one step closer. Okay, you go first. They'll see who's worthless. I'll wipe those smug looks off their faces. Who are you talking about? I'm talking about all of them. Everybody who lives in this cursed town. And everybody who thinks they're better than me just because I... Because they have everything and I have nothing. But soon I'll have everything. He's got issues. Whatever. Oh, I think I see what I'm looking for. This is not going to end well for us. Kaboom! Oh! Okay. You have died. That was not necessarily the best thing to happen. Oh, what just happened? Seems like I'm alive and back home. Under the circumstances, I'm not sure that's good news. I need to go back and get that diary. Right, yeah, I'm not sure that's good news at all. We've just, like, been fricasseed. Fricasseed? Fricasseed? Fricasseed, I think it is. Toasted. Flambeed. However you want to call it. It wasn't good. It wasn't... Oh. Wow. Just wow. How did you do it? I don't know. I just went back to my hut. Great. It, I should be used to it. Life gives me lemons all the time. You're such a useless idiot, and yet you're immortal. That's not totally fair. That's totally not fair. You're charming. I hate you. Pardon me? I hate you. Let me write this down. Graveyard keeper can't die. Hmm. Actually, I could use your help. Now that your immortal ass is here, I've decided that I don't want to die in this dungeon. What dungeon? Right up here. It was here even before the church, and nobody knows how deep it goes. The first inquisitors fought something down there before the ancient contract. How can I help you? I have my sources, so I always know where to find what I need. At this point in my plan for retribution, a lot of things I need are in that dungeon. First, I need a bucket of blood and five bloody nails. You should be able to find them on one of the first levels, where the pagans were tortured. This doesn't sound like a very nice place. I'm not sure that I want to go down there. Uh, right, well, I can come in here. And we have a keeper's diary. Most useful. Most useful indeed. Uh, I can't use or equip, so I need to take that keeper's diary over to the, the, the dude over there. Skulls in the wall, zero of five. Skulls in a column, dark design desk. Okay, we've got some mystical, all sorts of spookiness going on here. I'm not really sure what we're going to do with that. We'll get to that later. We've got more stuff over this way. Let's have a look. Let's go around. And if we go in here, you can break those. Anything else with that? What about you? Uh, there's nothing there. There's a diary. There's a book right there. Surely I can read the book. Apparently I'm not allowed to read the book. But I can chop up this. Chop you up there. There's a couple flitches. I needed them. Open. This gate is closed. Looks like I'll need a key to open it. I have a key. What key? Uh, I have a keeper's key. Oh, I don't have the other key anymore. Maybe I need the other key. What do I do with the key? I'm going to put the keeper's key in a chest somewhere. We've got some metal scraps. Um, I'm guessing it's important that I be able to get into that other dungeon in there. Oh, no. There's there's some other stuff in here. Let's have a look. We've got a, well, we've got a rack there. That's quite frankly not a very pleasant thing to look at. And then in here I go kaboom. Chop those down and everything's fine. Okay. We'll head back down this way and I want to... No. What do I want to do? I'm going to just drop the keeper's key up here because otherwise I'm going to forget about it. Then we want to go down to the morgue and we want to build the storage in there. And we want to process the two bodies in there. And we also want to take the funeral urns. I'll leave that one there. I'm not going to leave anything else behind. Not at the moment. We're on a roll, ladies and gentlemen. We are on a roll. I want to go out this way. I want to come down here. I'm pretty sure I've got everything I need. We are going to need a load of planks. Something that we will work on later. I'm not going to worry about the planks right now. But no, I want to go to build. And I want to go to mortuary. That's what I want. Mortuary rack. Right. Now. Uh, I can't. Seriously? I can't, like, put it in a... Uh, well, I, I guess I could put it there. I kind of like to put it next to the table there. I thought it would be better if I could put it... Right, we'll put it there. We'll put it there if that's where it wants us to put it. That's where we'll put it. And then we'll do this. And we'll put that one together. I've used more than what I needed to. So 
I've only got one space. It's going to be a lot of backwards and forwardsing. To and, and fro in on there. That's okay. I'll, I'll run up to the um, church a second. There, now open. And that will allow me to put all of this stuff in here. So, it's going to make life a little bit easier for me. Just to, like, very quickly run through some of those. If I bring this over this way a minute, though. And I go to that one. And then in here I can leave the story. Don't want to leave... Anything else? Nope, nope, nope. I don't want to leave anything else. So we need to go and see now the lighthouse keeper in our next one. And we're going to, you know, obviously we don't want to forget prayer day. But uh, th there's another thing that I would like to do. And that is, I'm going to take everything out of this one. I'm going to extract a whole lot. Um, yeah, is we do actually want to do the work for the um, evil guy up on the witch hill. The horrible, nasty inquisitor man that I don't like. We, we are actually going to want to do some work for him. Right, now, when you remove the brain and the other soft parts, it it removes random amounts of um, skulls. So there, look, we've removed random amounts there. I've also got a surgeon's mistake there. We don't want... Surgeon's mistakes are bad, right? That's, that's not a good thing to happen. Uh, but it is random amounts, so you don't really want to remove any of them at all. You just want to leave them in there and then... Okay. I'll have to go back around here and just pick them. We're getting it. Think things are getting a little bit crowded. We we'll drop off those three there. Hang on a minute. Is that like going on to the shelf now? Is that like putting stuff on the shelf? If I put all of those, it is. Okay, that thing is very cool looking. I like that. That is actually very good look. That is that is awesome. Right, get our last skull out of there. That'll add one. Red, oh, two reds. Okay, so we've got the body there. That one is ready to roll. Let's put you down here. And let me just go back to there a minute and drop those in. And then we'll pick you up. And I'm pretty sure i got to process you as well. This is going to get it. Yep. Okay, we'll take that out. I'll leave the soft parts in. No, I won't. I'm going to take everything out again. Just because I'm curious about um, whether or not they will stack in the mortuary rack or not. And They might. They might not. Who knows? It, it, it's, a thing, it's a thing I'm curious about. So take that one out there. That's removed a whole load of stuff. And this will turn one. Oh, we've got another one. Another one has just turned up. Fresh. Fresh and juicy. What are you looking like? So look, that's a six quality. It's got three skull. I'm going to leave that one on there for now. I'm not going to do anything else with it. I'm just going to leave it there. We'll deal with that later. Uh, no. Now back to work. I need to finish taking you out there and we got more stuff here that we want to remove there and yeah I was I'm taking everything out because what I'd like to do is I'd like to just see if these items will stack on the mortuary shelf because uh, they they won't stack on other shelves but they might stack on that shelf it might just be like this little thing that they do and I take the skull out there and I've run out of Energy. Of course I have. Drop you nope, they don't stack. Okay, so they don't stack anywhere. That's not a thing that can happen. Take you, and I'm going to put you in there like that. And then we go back over here. There's two more to pick up, and I will work through that one. This is almost it for today's episode. There we go. We take that one, and we'll drop you down there. Put you up there and drop those into there. So we've got a couple of these. And I'm not going to do very much more with them. Uh, I don't think I need to. That we could probably do with up in the house. So I'll take that with me. But the rest of it can stay down here. Uh, we want to take you. And then I want to go exit. Drop you down there. Just go and grab that next one a minute. Like that. Right. Slide you on down through here. I need to build a couple of these. So I still need yet more energy. One, two, three, four. Right. I see. It moved them out of the way. That's a good thing. Yeah, we're, we're burning energy quite fast now, I think. Uh, we're certainly using up energy more quickly than we were because we need desperately to go to sleep. So put that one on there and we'll get that one and we'll put that one on there. And then we will light these up like this and light that one up like that. 
And then while they burn down, I'm going to run up and I'm going to get a little bit of kip. And then once we've done that, we can get the ash and then we're ready to start building the columbarium. But that's going to have to be tomorrow. We will go and get the ash, though. We will go and do that because um, otherwise we're going to forget all about it. So let's have a little bit of the sleep that we desperately, desperately need. Like that. We'll go to about halfway, I think. There we go. That's enough. That should Everything should be ready down the bottom. We're going to grab those. We bring them back up, we can make those two, and then we've got to make the columbarium. And I don't remember what I need to be able to make that columbarium. That's the other thing that I want to check. So we pick up all of those, and all of those, and then we can run up this way, and we can just check what we need to make the columbarium. I think that it is um, some stone right there. Those 12 and four polished bricks. Okay, I can do that. Four polished bricks plus the 12 uh, urns. That we can do. We'll, uh, well, we'll do that next time. So anyway, if you've enjoyed this episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.